Stew back with Raid Shadow Legends Spirit Keep. It was open yesterday and I wanted to do a video just in case you wanted to see what the Spirit Keep boss does if you forgot. I know it's a little bit boring, but I want to cover all content in the game just to have it out there. I'm going to put out two other videos today, so it's not a problem. And I brought out an old friend of mine, Executioner. I tried to make it as rare friendly as possible. Executioner is a lot of fun. He got a bad rap when he got when he got nerfed months and months ago because he was very strong as a rare. He's still a lot of fun. His 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 AoE, which you're going to see in just a minute, it reduces turn meter and, and can put a slow speed slow speed debuff on people so he's still he's still great i think he has a fantastic kit but we're here to talk about spirit keep and the boss so let's see what she does she heals herself for 50 percent of her max hp each turn and even if you get that heal block up which is what you need on her you need it you need a champion with heal block or just bring in a lot of dps or turn meter reduction and bring her down but if you have a heal block, she can still remove it and place a block debuffs buff on her for two turns. But it's on a long cooldown, so that's not really a problem. You can wait it out. She hits decently hard, I guess. My guys are all pretty tanky. You saw what she did on Coldheart here, who is only 50 and not that well geared. You know, Coldheart's kind of fragile anyways, so it's not that bad. I think she's one of the easiest dungeons the spirit keep is one of the easiest ones in the game and I don't even think I, I wind up applying uh, a heal block <laughs> on her I think I wind up just knocking down her turn meter so much that we just do enough damage that she dies so it really doesn't even show me putting on a heal block but really all you have to do is put on a heal block and you'll be fine we got a slow speed on her and we've been doing a turn meter reduction on her with Lua and Coldheart so I think that is pretty much how it's gonna play out there it goes she went back to zero she was about to take a turn and I have four rares we're at almost two minutes like I said spirit keep seems very easy but there were her there were her passives and active abilities there's my team and that's it for the video I really don't have much else for spirit keep but I just wanted to put out everything there is in the game just to have it out there so i'll see you guys on the next one